Welcome. In this video, we're going to show you how to create a recurring event for your organization. A recurring event is a volunteer opportunity that will repeat or continue on a weekly, monthly, quarterly, semesterly, or yearly basis. Before we begin, make sure you're logged in. Please navigate to your organization's management page and create a new event. If you need a refresher on how to create an event, please watch our How to Create an Event video. To make an event a recurring volunteer opportunity, we first need to make the event type a volunteer opportunity in the leftmost dropdown. Next, we need to determine what kind of volunteer opportunity it will be. Click on the dropdown to the right of the event type. For a recurring event, you can choose an open opportunity or recurring event. An open opportunity is a volunteer opportunity which volunteers can sign up for at any point the event is live. Please note that you cannot add shifts or time slots to this type of event. A recurring event is for a volunteer opportunity that repeats on a weekly, monthly, yearly, quarterly, or semesterly basis. You can add time slots or shifts by selecting one of the options in the rightmost dropdown. For more information about shifts and time slots, please watch our Shifts and Time Slots Explained video tutorial. After you make these selections, proceed to fill in the relevant event information. You should then click the white Save and Continue button in the bottom right-hand corner. This will advance you through additional options in creating registration questions for your event in the left-hand sidebar. If you would like to learn more about registration questions, please watch our Creating Registration Questions video tutorial. Once you've finished filling out all the details of your event, be sure to click the blue Publish button in the bottom right-hand corner to make your event visible. After you've published the event, you can go to the event page and see how potential volunteers would view the event. Here's an example of a common open opportunity event. Similarly, Here's an example of a common recurring event. Here's a summary of the steps to create a recurring event. A written summary will also be available in the description of this video. If you're interested in watching any of these additional tutorials, please click the title now. Thank you for watching this video. If you run into problems or have any difficulties, please don't hesitate to reach out and contact us.